Hi, I'm attorney Bill Bronchick, and I want to discuss with you how you can use a land trust to hold title to your real estate to give you anonymity, privacy, and protection. A land trust is a revocable living trust. You've probably heard of revocable living trusts before, but not 100% sure on exactly what kinds of trusts there are. A living trust is a trust created while you're alive. That's all a living trust is. A revocable trust is one that is like it sounds, revocable, changeable, or terminable at your direction. So a land trust is a revocable living trust. It can be changed, it can be altered, it can be taken back, it can be terminated, and it's created while you're alive. Now a land trust is created by a trust agreement, not like a corporation or LLC, which is created by statute, created by filing and articles with the state. A land trust does not have a state filing, in fact, there is no public place where land trusts are recorded, which gives you the privacy and anonymity factor that an LLC cannot provide. You create a land trust by signing a trust agreement between you and the trustee who's going to manage the trust property. After the trust agreement is signed, the property is then transferred by deed into the name of the trust and recorded down at the county clerk and recorder's office. This is the only document that is recorded, the deed. The trust agreement is not recorded and therefore nobody but you and the trustee will know who the owner of the trust is, also known as the beneficiary. Now the beneficiary of the land trust can be you as an individual or it can be a corporate entity such as an LLC, a corporation, a series LLC, or a limited partnership, or even another trust. This will give you even further anonymity and privacy protection. No one but you and the trustee will know who owns the trust property because there's nothing recorded publicly that dis uh, disseminates this information. The land trust does not have a federal tax ID number, nor does it file a tax return. The beneficiary of the trust, whether it be you or a corporate entity, is the taxpayer. So by simply transferring your property from your own name to a land trust, of which you're the beneficiary, there is no change in tax reporting which makes it convenient and easy to use. You can also change beneficiaries underneath the trust by using an assignment of beneficial interest form. This can change the beneficiary from you to an LLC or a corporate entity such as a series LLC, limited partnership and so forth. The beauty of the land trust is the trustee is the only one who knows who the beneficiary is and if the trustee has a different last name than yours and preferably resides in another state out of the jurisdiction of some of the courts in within the state where the property is, you'll get maximum protection. To learn all about land trusts and how they can work for you, including all the forms you need to set it up and use it with state-by-state -state instructions, get my How to Create a Land Trust Step-by-Step -step Home Study course. I look forward to hearing about your success with land trusts.